Yo, what's good, fans of Five Fans? This your boy JB Trap House Boxing back again with another video. Shout out to the LDBC, smash that like and that subscribe button. Share the video I always and leave your thoughts and comments at the end of the video. And if you're looking for that exclusive street news, you already know what to do. Go subscribe to Urban Media Fix and hit that notification icon bell so you miss this heat that's being dropped. Urban Media Fix. Also, go subscribe to the Smoke City Mobcast. Tonight's the night, every Wednesday night, the LDBC. We get together, you know we do. So go subscribe, tune in, share the video, like always. And hit that notification icon bell so you don't miss the heat that we, that's being dropped every Wednesday night, 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time from the LDBC. All right, real quick, man. I just want to tap into this, man. Uh, <clears throat> salute to everybody who made the videos. This is shit that we all been talking about, but I'm going to, you know, take it just a little further. Just a little bit. Not much. You know, just add a little bit more to it. But uh, <clears throat> I'm going to tell you something, man. <clears throat> In my opinion, I, th I wouldn't be surprised if Triple G vacate all them damn belts. I'm being honest with y'all. I wouldn't be surprised if he vacate all those damn belts, and I'm explaining to you why. Okay. First of all, Triple uh, Canelo put a hurting on him. He was he was depending on Canelo. Canelo was his retirement check. He was depending on that bad big time. Shit didn't fail through, <laughs> you know. He's not gonna. He's not willing to be able to take the thirty-five percent. Even if he does take the thirty-five percent, Canelo, it's a good chance Canelo ain't fighting him right away. You understand what I'm saying? So either way, go. They're gonna play games when Canelo's gonna get a tune-up fight. He's gonna have to be forced to either fight a mandatory to take a toll on his body or vacate the belt. Canelo's gonna string him along as long as he wants to. You understand what I'm saying? That's just the bottom line. So he can play games with him if he wants. And on top of that, the shout out to Mauricio Suleiman. He uh he applied more pressure on Triple G, put the vice grips on him, and demanded if he don't get this fight with Canelo in September, which is he, I'm guarantee he probably won't. <laughs> he got to face Jamal Charlo, WBC mandatory. Hmm. So on top of that, the IBF got pressure on him. Saying that he, if he don't get this fight with Canelo, he has to fight Sergio De, Sergio Sergey Dervinchenko. Hmm. On top of that, Danny Jacobs is his WBA mandatory. Hmm. Wow. On top of that, to allegedly Canelo and Billy Joe in talks. Allegedly, I'm gonna get that's a whole nother video. Hmm. So Triple G's whole plan is this. I I'm gonna tell you, this is the safe route he can be. He got to fight that dude from Japan, the Murata guy, Mori, whatever how you say his name. It's a bigger payday. If he's going to pay that right, he's gonna have to fight this guy. You got to vacate his belts because they're gonna strip him. Or either vacate they strip him. And he goes to one sixty eight at a catch weight and fight. Uh, a guy like De De uh, James DeGale or somebody like that. You hope he can get a decent payday and hope that he can fall back and get a, a, a Canelo fight later on, but he's not going to be able to stick around at no 160 and hang in there with no, no Jamal Charlo, Dervinchenko, uh, or even fight Danny Jacobs again because uh, uh, Abel Sanchez and was, was sweating and waving their hands. They was like, whoo, thank God we don't got to deal with uh, Danny Jacobs again. You know, they, they're not trying to revisit that. Not at all. I mean, they're not trying to revisit that at all. They know that was a close call. They, it, a lot of people thought that Triple G lost that fight, period. So they ain't going that route. They're not going to Derbychenko. The, the risk ain't worth the reward. They don't think they can win that fight. He's a, This dude is a tough guy, a hard inside fighter, going to push him to the limit. He ain't going to go that route. You know, they definitely ain't fighting no circuit Devichenko. Then we got man, I ain't even speak about uh uh y'all 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 boy uh god damn, he don't even fight that much. Boo boo, boo boo Demetrius Andrade. We we ain't brought up him. He lingering in the mix. So out of those guys, I don't see Triple G really fighting nothing. Now, if he had a chance, he might could have took the chance. The fighting Billy Joe, he may have, but that I don't. He he can't beat Billy Joe. He can't beat Billy Joe, and I tell y'all this guys all the time, and and I mean this. I I don't think none of those guys beat Billy Joe, none of them. And that's just the real. 
But that's a whole nother video too And let me explain to y'all why But Triple G Is in a hard hard situation right now Fellas ladies and gentlemen Oh what the fuck is that He's in a hard hard situation right now And Look man If he gonna go for the money grabs He gonna have to fight that dude over there in Asia And he's gonna have to uh, Go, go uh, Cherry pick at super middleweight That's his best bet I don't. Other than that, I don't see him uh, doing anything else in middleweight. Those guys are too much of a uh, hassle and a headache for him. They don't generate enough revenue. You understand what I'm saying? He damn sure can't beat Charlo. You know, he ain't going to fight Charlo. That's too much for him. Uh, like I said, Dervinchenko is too much. Demetrius Andre ain't bringing enough to the table. He's, he's not. He's, this guy is not trying to unify. He already said... Unification is no longer, no more longer a priority. So be prepared for Gennady Golovkin to cherry pick the rest of his career out. I keep telling y'all this. I don't know why people don't believe it, but you'll see. And uh, I'm just telling y'all, man, this guy's gonna, he might, I wouldn't be surprised if he dropped all these belts. Just being honest with y'all. So y'all let me know what y'all think. This your boy JB, I'm gone.